Hey guys, Brian here. Today we're going to take a quick look at the Kirk Hunter deal bundle that we have going on right now. So let's check it out. All right, guys. So I did a really, really quick piece um, with the Kirk Hunter bundle. So it includes the Kirk Hunter Virtuoso Ensembles, which will be brass, woodwind, strings, percussion, choir, and then it also has the 4D, the Spotlight Strings, which is a full symphonic string ensemble, and then also has, you know, solo strings um, for one to four uh, players, and then the full symphonic. So let's check it out real quick, and then we'll go through a little bit of uh, the content that's included. So that was just a really quick, you know, rundown of some of the stuff that's included. So I start with the brass ensembles. Um, this is the Virtuoso Brass Ensemble. So let's take a look real quick. Um, there's a, quite a bit of, you know, different articulations also with the soft tongue and medium tongue, the way how hard the attack is on the actual note that's played. And then we have shorts, staccato, staccatissimo, sforzando, marcados as well. And then the range, um, the different brass instruments are mapped across the keys. So tubas, trombones, French horns, and trumpets, uh, depending on where you play. <laughs> Uh, the reverb can be turned off. You can add your own reverb to taste because um, it is kind of a bit wet when you, when you first play it. Um, then I have a woodwind patch here. This is from the Virtuoso wind, Woodwind Solos, but it's every single woodwind instrument mapped across the keyboard. Again, get totally dry with it. And what I have them doing here is just this. So you can also have um, legato as well. And then I like how, you know, you hold the note and it gets a nice kind of natural vibrato with it. Um, we'll check out the legato on the woodwinds a bit um down here so the 4d strings is next let's check that out we also have an option to use just the solo strings um you click on here and it goes from one two three four so a four uh quartet there and then you click in the background there and it, it enables the full symphonic section. So of course we also have different articulations there with tremolo. Um, 
um, how hard you press the key depends on how hard the attack is on the note, as you could hear. Shorts. Whole and half trills. And then also this slur is enabled for the legato, which gives it a, you know, a nice slurred bow on that. All right, there's also a choir here. Just, you know, kind of a sketching choir there. Then I have the pizzicato strings here, the tubas. So it's not a solo tuba, so it has, you know, kind of a bite to it as well. Then I have the solo woodwinds kind of taking turns down here. Um, so you can hear the legato on this better since they're kind of isolated and you can hear the uh, transitions. So again, we get, you know, nice legato transitions. The flute, you could see there, I had it as the medium tongue, and the soft tongue sounds a bit, you know, more lyrical. And then, of course, when you hold out the note, you get a nice natural vibrato. So that was just a really, really quick look, you know, kind of the different articulations you get. Um, so you get ensemble brass, um, strings, Woodwind, uh, solo woodwinds, so not ensemble woods, and then the 4D strings will have solo strings in there as well as the full symphonic ensemble. And there's also, you know, some little goodies like the choir, the percussion, and stuff like that. Um, all in all, a nice orchestral package and very low price. Great for sketching, great for producers who need, you know, a little bit of orchestral strings here and there. Um, so yeah, that was that. Make sure you um, like the video. If you want to support us, let us know what you think. Um, and of course, turn on those notifications when you subscribe so you know when we go live and I will see you guys next time. Thanks so much.